welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Danny. I normally just blog about like fashion and music and show an insight into my little life, my little weirdo life. But obviously it is Halloween season. So this video is another Halloween haul. And this is from Poundland and Pound Stretcher. Put those two stores together because they're very similar. This is our little goodie bag. The bag itself also came from Poundland as well. I just thought it was so cute and I forgot to take my reusable one with me. So picked up another one. <laughs> Normally these two stores are full of crap. It's the only way to describe it. I mean, if you're throwing a children's Halloween party, hit them up. They're great. They've got the napkins, the paper plates, you've got tinseled stuff and like cheaply made plastic or cardboard signs and stuff like that whereas I like to look for the slightly longer lasting stuff so I'm not spending a fortune every single year I don't want it to last one season and then have to throw it away because that clutters up the planet and waste of money so first things first we're going to start with pound stretcher Purely because I've got a really dry fright. Dry fright? Ah! Dry throat. And this is my new Halloween mug. So this is just this little cute little pirate guy. It's very like pudsly giving me here. And we got like coloured bats and spider webs all over it. And this was from Pound Stretcher. So I'm just going to have some tea. Oh, that's better. Okay, so let's crack into this bag. We'll start with the pound stretcher stuff. So I got these two little glitter pumpkins. They're both exactly the same. These are made of um, cheap foam. And the glitter does has been coming off like a little bit, but I'll show you these. So it's just plain pumpkin, self-explanatory, and like a gold top. I might have to paint over the gold bits because that doesn't fit my vibe at all. But yeah, I've got these two little pumpkins. I'm keeping on the pumpkin theme. I also got, because this was so, so sweet, this one. Look, it's this teeny tiny little glitter pumpkin. Again, this is molten, so I'm just getting orange glitter everywhere, but... How cute is this? Woo! I'm dropping it now. So yeah, I got these ones here and they were all like, the three of them were quite cheap, so I don't mind. <laughs> and I, they were too cute not to. The other piece I got was this little rat. Now he is like made of plastic, but he's quite sturdy. So he's not really gonna break anywhere. And it's just this rat skeleton. Look at his little face. <laughs> Look at him. <clears throat> we need to name him. Um, I was kind of thinking along like the lines of Edgar. But if you have got any better names, shove them down in the comment box below. And we shall name this rat together, I think. He is so sweet. All right, moving on to Poundland because like I said, normally it's just full of crap, but this year, oh, this year, seriously, you need to go to Poundland if you in the UK because, oh my God, the stuff was good this year. We'll start with the smaller pieces. Oh, okay. So I got two of these. I'm dropping tags everywhere. So I got two of these cute little, look at these. Look how sweet these are. These are little light up ghosts. Um, the batteries are included inside it, but let's pull out the, pull out the taggy bit and let's see if we can get this to You, not that you can see that in this light. Hang on. 
let me dim my lights down so we can try and see this. There we go. Look at that, and he changes colour. So he goes like all different colours. Is that better? That's better. So yeah, I got two of them. If I remember rightly, I put it in here. Because not everything was a pound, but they were. So these two cute little guys were like a pound each. <laughs> I could have got way more. Just like colour my house in these light up ghosts. Who needs electric when you've got light up ghosts to light up your house with? <coughs> oh, my throat. This is what I get for trying to quit smoking. Oh. Okay, right, the next piece. Sticking to the light up theme. This one was more than pounds, so this was two pound, but look at this. So we got this white top and this pumpkin in it. Again, this lights up. Um, but this is actually quite solid glass it's like or resin it's actually really nice it's quite weighty to it as well so for two quid you're thinking okay cool and i don't know if you can see it because of the glare but on the actual glass itself it's got like this fractured -y, spider webby cracked look on it So you got that one. The other small piece I got <coughs> was this um, awesome spider. Here he is. <laughs> now he is a bendable moving spider so you can <coughs> move him to your whim. So if we get all his legs out, he, has, he does have eight legs, doesn't he? Yeah, he does have eight legs. And so you, like, you could attach him to like a frame or something like that that's my plan anyway but look at his little tiny red eyes there <laughs> it's so sweet so you got this little spider and then i think i got i went basically went to poundland with my friend um after the as the fiasco i needed cheering up so he took me halloween shopping <coughs> and i saw this and I knew it was going to come home with me. Are you ready? <laughs> Look at this guy. <laughs> so this is this really cute little um, bowie cat. I mean, black cat. He's got his little string legs. And these little witchy boots with silver buckles on him. And he's holding his little pumpkin. Look at his little silver nose. <coughs> oh, I was so overexcited when I saw this. It's so cute. Okay, so the last piece I got was five pounds. But, oh, wow, is it worth it? So this is a pumpkin glass jar. It's a glass jar in the shape of a pumpkin. And I was like, oh, that's going to be like cheap plastic, isn't it? They're going to overprice it. It's going to be £5 for some cheap plastic bucket kind of thing. No, no. <coughs> I was very pleasantly surprised. So I checked this out when I was in the store. I was that person. I, was, I opened up the box because I wanted to see. Also, again, after that Asda stuff... <laughs> I wanted to make sure everything I was getting was not broken. <laughs> it's like traumatised me. I'm like, please don't be broken. Just like carrying it around like a child so it doesn't break. But yeah, when I open this, this is, so this is the lid. And this is proper glass. And it's quite weighty. Poundland, you've done me good this year. So this is the lid. And then, if I move this box out of the way, this is the bucket itself. Again, quite thick glass. And it's just, wow. So 
that is going to be awesome because I also got some um, monster lollies. They're not shaped like monsters or anything. This is the Swizzles brand because I trust them because they're always vegan. <coughs> and the reason I got lollipops is because I should have quickly like, briefly mentioned I'm trying to quit smoking. And lollies really help me. So lots and lots of lollies. I mean, if we get trick-or-treaters this year, I might share them. But chances are we're not. Because we live on quite closed streets. So we don't really get trick-or-treaters. And they are going to live in my little pumpkin jar. How cute is that? With all my little sweets. Obviously, I will fill it up more. <laughs> I'm going to... Not that these are going to last long, probably, but... So that is it for the pound stretcher and the poundland haul. That was basically the good stuff I could find. So yeah. Um think of a name for our little rat guy over here. I feel like a pirate if I have him on here. Um so yeah, <laughs> let's think of a name up for him. I'm feeling Edgar, but if you've got anything better, let me know down in the comments. It's just say hey. Um how's your haul hunting going or have you got anything good have you had some really bad experiences like i have <laughs> i really hope not i hope you're not having a horrible season so far and i will see you on the next one don't forget to click that thumbs up and subscribe to my channel see you